guys, if you are catching this live right now, disregard. This is tomorrow's workout. Um, it's arms for Friday, okay? It's arms and um, abs. So pass me by. It'll be on the timeline for you tomorrow morning, or you could do it later today. It's up to you. Um, I'm, you know, doing the, the shoulder and, and arms together, I don't think it's that much of a um, burden. So uh, cheers if you want to do it with me, okay? Looks like it's going to be quick and easy. So, um, wide curl, incline. So, that means if you can put your bench up on an incline, you're going to be reclining, and it's going to be kind of like a concentration curl, okay? And then, um, uh, then I want a one, a one dumbbell curl, and then those drag curls. We did drag curls for back day, and I want you to focus on the drag curl this time, and I want you to think about your bicep, okay? Fair enough. And I'm going to put this up one more notch. You'll see if your arms are hanging, right, it'll be enough. There. Hang on, I just want to change something over here. Perfect. Okay. So, yeah, I'm heading out this afternoon, and I just thought, okay, I'll get the biceps, triceps done, and I'll feel good about that. And we can finish up the week together. You're on your own on Saturday and Sunday, and we start our new session on Monday. So I'm excited about that. I've got all the boards ready for next week, and I'm kind of like, you know, building up my. Uh... There we go. Okay, and big. All right. So, 10, 10, 10. Just go a little lighter to begin with and just see how it goes. for next week and so I used a smaller little guy to here's your drag okay do you feel the difference there you might fool around with that drag coral thinking about your upper back and pulling that way and then pulling through here. It hits both areas and it's your focus that counts. Take a break. Yeah. Three times, three times, and three times. This is a really sweet workout. It's a goodbye um, Friday. Although those abs look a little bit Challenging. I'm going to try this um, wide angle reclined curl. Sitting up and a single arm. 
We're going to do something similar with a hammer curl um, in our next superset. So. already. So this is all bicep, then it's tricep, bicep, and then it's all triceps, okay? So, sneaky there. Little sneaky. Drag. Drag follows the uh, line of your body up. Elbows press out back, and you should be able to focus in on the concentrate, concentration on the bicep curls. And ten. Holy smokes. No comment. One more set here. Put the um, bench down on a flat for a skull crusher. Or you could be on the floor, right? Skull crusher, you can use one weight. I've actually been using a um, kettlebell. You could use a barbell, right? You try and get 10 out with my 10. We'll work on it. that hits that bicep in a slightly different way. If you were at a gym, you might have the, um, the bar that has all the angles, all right? You might have just a barbell with a close grip. All right, there's many ways to get that um, uh, close grip um, bar, uh, bicep curl and uh, drag curls. Your elbows bend back. 
Joint action is elbow only, okay? You're not swinging your arm um, at, the, at the shoulder. That being said, you might position it a little bit further so you can get a little bit more uh, stretch there, okay? Uh, play around with it. You want to feel this in your triceps, the back of your arm. Another one where the positioning is a little bit off of our usual. Right? 10 and 10, three times. This is good. Excuse me. When you're ready, all right, we're really hammering the same muscle group, and it's a small muscle group over and over and over. So if you need to take a little more time in between sets, then you take that. You want to have good reps, okay? You don't want to be um, cheating them up all the way, okay? You want to move your weight. our first um, couple sets for triceps, right? So they're just warming up now and then uh, coming into our uh, dips next. signal today. Sorry about that, you guys. So strange. Uh, tricep. Uh, skull pressure. Um, there we go. One weight, two weights, barbell. Well, not really last set. We've got the concentration curls, but 10 reps.
Good. Concentration, six and six. This is where my 12 pound weight would come in so handy. I got 15. I don't know, I might see. And then half dip, um, you're just gonna just kind of stay up at the top for about, what does it say, 10? And then you're gonna go deep, as many as you can, okay? Watch your shoulders on that one, right? Stay quite close, keep your back quite close to your um, bench. And the same with your arms. They're not out here too far, okay? That is gonna cause a lot of pressure on your shoulders. So keep them quite close to your body so that you're working, that you're carrying your load over, over um, a solid foundation for your, uh, or a solid position for your shoulders. Well, I'm gonna give it a go. 15 pounds. <laughs> I might surprise myself. Concentration curls, six and six, and then the dips. Glad I did that. Here comes those um, partials for about 10 and then full. Or go the other way around. Do as many partials as you can and uh, 10 full ones. And I'm going to go into a full dip one. my um, um, the difficulty of this movement a little bit uh, a little bit easier all right if you extend your legs out further it gets more difficult you could also put a weight on your um, hips on your lap and make it more difficult okay um, I, I don't usually like to fool around too much with shoes, right enough problems as it is so uh, yeah, that's why I keep it to safe Fifteen, twelve again. I have difficulty personally with um, abs going too high reps, so um, I'm gonna modify those numbers for myself, and you'll do the same thing, right? Okay, we sit uh, knee tuck, which is I call it an accordion. Uh, v sit bicycle. We're just gonna. Oh. 
like, oh, and then in a um, mountain climber position. You know, to, again, to be fair, you can pick any three um, core exercises. And I know a couple people have to modify um, abs and uh, just follow along doing your own thing that works for you. out of that, that last one too. Good, 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 good. Okay, ready, set for abs. All right, back, back. Go on, go. Okay, get everything out of the way. And 20. Good. Again, quads and hip flexors. Yeah, a lot of these ab exercises, this area staying isometrically contracted and holding you stable so that the hip flexors do the work of the legs, right? Ready for set number two, the knee tuck. You could be up on a bench, right? Uh, for any of this, it could be elevated. All right, up tall and...
to know that. Good. V-sit bicycle. You could be lying down for a bicycle. I'll do that one with you. So you can be up here for a bicycle or seated for a bicycle or lying, lying back. And plank, cross, strike. One more set. Uh, this is 12. 12 reps. Good. Alrighty, here I go. Got a Tabata. I'm going to do Tabata Jacks. I'm going to modify because I'm feeling quite <laughs> challenged today. Um, um, so you showing up on a Friday should be fresh from yesterday. From Thursday's workout, you're going to do your Tabata, bicycle, treadmill, skipping. Um, choose your weapons and get it done. Here we go. 10 seconds um, on the uh, warm up. So once I get this all taken care of, are you ready? And then your weekend is yours, right? So you can get out and do something active. Um, when you're watching this, I'll be out on a hike. Hopefully the weather is beautiful. And um, yeah. I'm not a wimp when it comes to, you know, doing something physical out in nature, but I like it to be nice, the weather, right? Okay. Okay, so I have, oh, well, I thought I had the um, interval timer here. I do not. Let me just take a second to get interval timer. It'll just take two seconds here. Uh, Tabata, and I'm not going to put the 10 seconds on it. We're just going to get started with 20 seconds. I'm doing jacks, and I'm modifying as much as I need to. Just get moving, okay? So. And 10 
seconds rest. Good. Set three for a Tabata. And this movement to something else. Step ups, knee ups. Hello, whoever came. We're almost finished here, and this is Friday's workout, okay? This is not today's workout. We've done it already. Okay. I believe we're halfway there. I might change now. I'm going to go to knees up. Good. And big arms, big legs. Tabata and feeling that my arms. Two seconds and go. One more round. Wow, I feel <laughs> every part that we did this past week is coming into. Say hello again. <laughs> Happy Friday, you guys. This will remain on the timeline for you to do tomorrow. Um, you could do it now, you could do it tonight, but uh, there it is. Finish off your week strong and new session, Monday. Very excited. All right, you guys, have a great afternoon. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me, Deb. <laughs> uh, have a good weekend. <laughs>